The new Audi RS e-tron GT, is a sleek four-door high-performance all-electric sedan, with coupe-like styling. This is a vehicle that needs to meet customer expectations, and deliver polished performance. According to Audi head of design, RS e-tron GT, is the best-looking vehicle he's ever designed. The e-tron GT is one of the best-looking EV out there. It will compete against the Tesla Model S Plaid, and its own corporate sibling the Porsche Taycan Turbo. The Audi stands out from the Porsche, with its more chiseled bodywork and busier front end. For those who like Audi's distinctive design touches, they're all present in the RS e-tron GT. Powered by a 93.4 kW lithium-ion battery, producing 590 horsepower, and 612 pound-feet of torque. With overboost function, temporarily boosts output to 637 horsepower. The power is sent to two electric motors, one at the front axle, and another at the rear. The rear motor is also equipped with a two-speed transmission, with the first gear used for aggressive acceleration. RS e-tron GT, can also be recharged from 5 to 80% in 23 minutes, using the standard 270 kW DC fast charger. A full charge on a 240 volt outlet takes around 9 hours, and Audi predicts 232 miles per full charge. The RS GT can sprint 0 to 60 in 3.1 seconds. Top speed, 155 mile per hour. The interior is also unmistakably Audi. The cabin incorporates multiple digital displays on its angular dashboard, along with upscale trim. Audi offers a leather interior, with different color options, as well as a leather-free package that uses recycled materials. A 12.3-inch digital cluster, sits behind the wheel, while a single 10.1-inch touchscreen, houses the latest MMI system, and can be controlled by steering wheel-mounted controls, and voice recognition software. Standard features, wireless Apple CarPlay, wired Android Auto, navigation, satellite radio, and two USB ports. A Wi-Fi hotspot, and a 16-speaker Bang & Olufsen sound system, are available. Porsche Taycan Turbo, is an innovative high-tech luxury all-electric sports sedan. The Taycan set the bar extremely high in the EV segment, with the most obvious comparison being the Tesla Model S, and Audi's just launched RS e-tron GT. As the first production EV, with an 800-volt architecture and a multi-speed transaxle, it sets new benchmarks in charging speeds and acceleration times. It also has the ability to make multiple high-speed runs, without a significant loss in performance. Although, it has a lesser driving range, than its primary rival the Tesla Model S, the Taycan drives like a Porsche sports car. Powered by a 93.4 kW battery pack, producing 616 horsepower, and 626 pound-feet, or 670 horsepower with launch control. The power is sent to two electric motors, one at the front axle, and another at the rear, with an innovative two-speed transmission. Taycan Turbo, can also be recharged from 5 to 80% in 22.5 minutes, using the standard 270 kW DC fast charger. A full charge on a 240 volt outlet takes around 9 hours. The Taycan Turbo offers 212 miles per full charge, and sprint 0 to 60 in 3.0 seconds. Top speed, 161 miles per hour. The Taycan Turbo interior, is impressively clean and covered in a range of rich materials. The seats are comfortable, and supportive. There's no shortage of screens inside the Taycan, but there is a shortage of physical buttons and knobs. The top one is integrated into the dash, and measures 10.9 inches, which provides access to important functions. The 8.4-inch touchscreen below it enables users to adjust the climate settings, interact with Apple CarPlay, and more. Another 10.9-inch touchscreen, is available for the front seat passenger, and there's a 5.9-inch touchscreen, in the back seat that controls the rear HVAC, and seat heating, when equipped. Also included are four USB-C ports, wireless charging, 
satellite radio, and a 10-speaker audio system. Android Auto is not available.